Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are doing well. This is a much requested video. This is an independence and rock shop London special where I create this simple yet elegant makeup look. And uh, if you want to see how I create this look, then keep on watching. To start off, I'm going to use a primer. This is the Red and Wild Photo Focus Dewy Finish Primer. I'm just going to take a little bit and set the base. So this is a dewy finish tinted primer and it helps to blur out all the unevenness and fill down the pores. It's a very beautiful primer. It helps to apply the makeup very smoothly on your face. So it is very important to set your base with a very good primer. Moving on to foundation today, I will be using the Makeup Forever HD foundation. This foundation is so beautiful guys. It looks so beautiful in the photographs and uh, for special occasions, I usually reach out for this. It has such a flawless finish and it looks very natural on your skin and it's a full coverage, beautiful foundation. So I'm gonna take a beauty blender and blend this out. This is a special occasion so I will be using the Wet n Wild Concealer Corrector and I'm just going to put it under my eyes and my nose because I get redness out here on my forehead, on my chin and I am going to put it on my eyes today Now I'll quickly set my face with powder. This is the Maybelline Fit Me Loose Powder and this is such a wonderful powder guys. This is going to last you for the longest time. So I'm just going to take my Real Techniques powder brush and I'm just going to dab under my eyes, my entire face because it's a hot and humid day today so it is very important that you set your face properly with a good powder so that your makeup stays in place and you don't sweat and the makeup doesn't melt away Now I'm going to use the Wet n Wild Ultimate Brow Kit and I'm going to fill my eyebrows. Moving on to my eyes, I will be using the Sofix Ultra Eyeshadows and this is a beautiful palette. Right here, you can see the beautiful colors right there. At first, I'm going to use this color as a transition and this is the color called Cloud Berry. Just going to put it right here. As you can see, this is so highly pigmented. Now with a blending brush, I'm going to just blend it up so that it looks smooth and there are no harsh lines. The green color shade and this is called Pine Tree and I'm going to use my fingers as this is a glitter shade and you can see it's so beautiful, it's like an olive green color. 
and I'm just gonna put it on my eyelids. As you can see that these colors are so pigmented and I'm again going to go in with my blending brush and blend it out a little bit. Now I'm going to use this eyeliner, this is a glitter eyeliner and I got this as a gift so I don't know where you get it. Uh, it is called Hilary Roda and I am just going to wing my eyes with this. As you can see, this is a beautiful green color and it's got glitter in it as well. I'm gonna take this shade again onto another brush and I'm just going to put it below my eyes. After this, I'm going to line my waterline with the Lacme Iconic Kajal in white. Open up my eyes a little bit. Moving on to mascara, I am just going to curl my lashes. And use the Maybelline Total Temptation Mascara. This mascara gives so much volume guys that I don't even need any falsies. Moving on to the face, I will be using the L'Oreal Face Monster. I'm gonna take my Real Techniques brush, roll it in and define my cheekbones. some definition to my jawline right here and my forehead moving on to blusher i will be using the makeup revolution blushing hearts in bursting with love this is such a beautiful blusher guys i'm going to use my pro art brush in pf07 and i'm going to take this darker shade right here and dab it on my Now I'm going to take this golden shimmer shade right here and I am just going to put it in the inner corner of my eye. Moving on to my favorite part, this is the highlighter from Sofax and hmm, thinking which color to use today. So I'm going to be taking this shade right here, I'm going to take my fan brush and just going to highlight my cheekbone. Cool. 
for lipstick today, I will be using the Nykaa Ultra Matte Lipstick in the shade Nefertiti. This is one of my favorite lipstick colors. And the formula is absolutely amazing and it stays for the longest time and it is not that matte. It is very comfortable. And there you have it. So this is the final look guys. Thank you so much for tuning in. I hope this video was helpful for you. Let me know in the comments down below if you like this video. And don't forget to like, share and subscribe this video. And I will see you soon in the next one. Ciao guys.